Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Grammy's Nature Nugget. So glad you're here today. Come up and sit on Grammy's quilt with me. It's good. Come up, Claire. Come up, Christian. Great, right in front. Today we're going to talk about the third most intelligent animal in the animal kingdom. We have already spoken of the first most intelligent and the second. And the first most intelligent, if you will recall, is the chimpanzee. The second most intelligent is an elephant. The third most intelligent animal is the one we're speaking of today. And it's a mammal and it lives in the ocean. And it is known for a famous series on TV that was called Flipper. Does anybody? That's right, Claire. That's so right. Dolphin. In fact, that was your dad's favorite video to watch on TV. Um, dolphins are mammals and there are over 36 species of dolphins. They breathe air through their uh, blowhole on the top of their heads and they have smooth skin and slender bodies and are excellent, excellent swimmers. They have over a hundred teeth in their mouth and they are cute and fun and such actors and interesting animals, so teachable. And we are going to see, uh, I think we have a picture up right now that shows the um, dolphin's teeth. And you can see over a hundred teeth in their mouth. Their eyes are on each side of their head and they operate independently. They can look ahead and beside and behind and see well under the water and above the water. They make so many sounds. Dolphins make clicking sounds, whistle sounds, and they speak to their other members of their pod, and they have screams and calls and moans and trills and grunts and squeaks and creaky door sounds. Dolphins have their own language. And they have sonar, which is they send messages out that bounce off of an object and it comes back to them and then they know the size. Um, we're going to see a video right now of the sounds that a dolphin makes. So listen carefully because you're going to hear the clicking sound and a high whistle. Today, I brought a coloring page and it says God made the dolphins. So we see this long slender body and has a dorsal fin on the top of the body and two fins on the very tail end which are called flukes. Then it has two flippers on the side, each side of its body. And those are called pectoral fins. Has an eye in the center and those are what we talked about. They operate independently. They can see beside and in front and in the back of themselves. A very small, very, very small spot on the side just be above the pectoral fin is where their hearing is. That's an ear actually. And then on the very top is where the blowhole is. And that's where they breathe from. Then this long snout has a hundred teeth in it. So make sure to color the body gray because this is a bottlenose dolphin. And um, you wanna make sure that it's colored gray. So enjoy that coloring sheet. Dolphins have great great hearing 
and their opening for the hearing is very small, but is excellent for hearing. They're entertaining, and they're performers. They swim fast, they leap clear out of the water, and they can swim upside down. They are just so much fun to watch. They're in all the oceans of the world. They work together to eat, and they herd um, schools of fish, and they have what are called group dining. <laughs> they are carnivorous, and that means they eat meat only, which is they eat fish and shrimp and octopus and squid. So they live in pods or groups that are called pods from five to a hundred. But in large pods, there's over a thousand that are living together of these dolphins, and that's called super pods. They live up to 40 to 50 years in the wild. And there was a dolphin that was recorded to have lived 90 years. That's an old dolphin. They have, they weigh up to 10 to 400 pounds. They don't eat or they don't drink water. They only eat the food that they eat has water in it. And that's how they get their fresh water. Um, Bottlenose dolphins are the most famous dolphins and Flipper was a bottlenose dolphin. They, bottlenose dolphins are somewhere between 12 and 20 feet long, and they can weigh up to a thousand pounds. They live in the deep oceans and in, along the shoreline or in river basins. So they live pretty much wherever there is water. God made the dolphins and let's pray today for the dolphins and for all of you kids. Let's pray together. Father in heaven, I want to thank you today for the dolphins. They are such intelligent and wonderful animals. Thank you, God, for making them and for having that communication between them and the human race. It's so much fun to see them in the wild, swimming and jumping out of the water. Bless the dolphins, Lord, and bless all the kids that are listening today. I pray that you protect each one. Thank you, Lord, for I ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you so much for being such good listeners today. I'm so glad you got to learn about the dolphin. The dolphin is just such a teachable, and I know that if you have ever been to SeaWorld or any of those places, you've seen how they can train the dolphin, and it's amazing. So do remember the dolphin is such a wonderful creation of God. Thanks so much for being here today. See you next time. Bye.